Yes, good afternoon and good day wherever you are in the part of the world. And this is AJ at Keytron. I'm going to present to you today the real chords. And this is with pertaining in particular to the AJAM Sonic Pro 1 package. What exactly are these chords and how can you use these chords to be able to enhance your existing instrument? So as described before, the real chords are chords that could be made up of any kind of instruments. It could be human voices, guitars, saxophone, flutes, keyboards, what have you. And these chords actually follow your performance. And again, the difference between them and regular chords is these were actually live instruments played by live musicians and that have been captured and now can be produced on the keyboard. And so the AJAM Sonic Package Pro 1 pack in particular has expanded this to give you even more. To get a feeling of this, we're going to compare a regular style, a factory style, with the regular content, and I'm going to bring in the real chords. So the style you just heard me playing right now, I'm going to go ahead and do it again, and this time I'm just going to play a little bit softer, a little bit slower. You can hear the style before and after I use some of these live real chords. So let's just, uh, you know, start this with a nice little introduction. So in that case there, all I did was I took the regular style that we have, a standard 8-beat that you have on the instrument itself, and I was able to go ahead and uh, perform just playing around with you know, the, the regular voices in there. Now, that same style which you have in this package, let's play that with the new real chords, okay? And for that I'm going to take you down to the screen here so I can show you first of all the entire panel, okay? load the style up and where do you find those chords if you go into view and modeling okay you're going to see over there where it says real chords let me go to your screen and in this case you can see that i have a new one there called sax praise and keys obviously meaning that this chord is going to be made up of saxophone and some keyboard parts as well too now take a listen to this that same style but now using these new real chords and in case you didn't notice we do have before us here the Event 61 and also the Event X. And I'm doing that because a couple of people have asked for uh, some questions with regards to what the differences are, if any, between the Event X and the Event. And that's coming up in another video very, very shortly. But for now, everything you're listening to is coming out of the Event 61. So let's go back before we get ourselves derailed here to the real court. Here we go. <laughs> Variation button, real chords. So what exactly is going there? You can also notice that apart from just having the different real chords that are performing with you in real time, we also have nice new VST pads that we're adding into there. So what we did, VST pads that we're adding into the mix. So what exactly do we do there? The real chords cannot, doesn't have to just be a particular instrument. You can actually have an entire mix, right? So in this case, we had a saxophone player, for example, keyboards, and those VST 
pass is what the keyboard player was playing. But we had the saxophone player and the keyboard player playing together. And of course, we recorded those in all the different keys. And so when you now play them, you are playing the keyboard part with the VST voices, and you're also playing the saxophone, the live saxophone part. Listen very, very closely. As a matter of fact, I'm going to mute the drums, I'm going to mute the bass, take out the chords, so you can just hear what the real chord by itself right there sounds like. Let's go back to that screen again where you can see it. Saxon praise in this particular case. Here we go. Version A. Just to explain to you what's happening there as well too, right? So if you notice, in this case with the package, what we've done is we want you to have control of when those particular parts come in and out of the style. So we've programmed this to respond to the variation button over here on the corner, right? So if I go into variation B, for example, and I turn off that variation, there is no additional real chords coming in, the extra pads or the voices, depending on what you choose, right? I can just play the style. I can get those nice pads in the background as I change my chords right here. Bring them in right now. So again, I'm just trying to demonstrate and illustrate what that can do, right? So if you notice, there was a lot that was going on and I was able to control when and where and how those pads and those additional real chords do come into the voicing. So this was just to give you a demonstration. You have a whole plethora. If I change over to my screen right here, you can see when you touch the trumpet praise too, it opens up the library and you can see a whole bunch of real chords in there. In this case, we are with the trumpets. You also have vocals. If I turn the wheel, I can see all new thank you, which are actually voices. So for an example, if I touch that thank you and I go ahead and still go up, you know, play the chord in that same style. Oh, 
pick another selection, pick another page. You want to pick the reggae? And this again is the beauty of this, being able to control the real chords in real time. Imagine being able to have musicians that are playing with you and for you, and you actually controlling them in real time. And mind you, it doesn't only end there. Even though these are audio files, if I speed that up, So that's just to give you a glimpse of what you are about to get yourself indulged with if you do get the uh, AJAM Sonic Pro Pack. Now, if you look at the description on the website, it does show that the package has been broken down. There's some people out there who just want styles, for example, and that's good. So they have styles and they have voices. And there are others who also do a lot of backing track material, be that with MIDI files, MP3, or karaoke files as well. So they can get the Elite package, which comes with everything. And then there are some of you out there who have specifically requested to have just these real chords and real bass. So for you guys, you can also get the other package which allows you to have access to all of these real chords. Now the beauty about this is all of these real chords can be used with existing styles that you have right now. That could be factory styles or it could also be your user styles. In other words, styles that you either purchased or that you brought into the keyboard from other sources. So I leave you with this. This package is a must have, especially for those of you who are trying to expand on your existing library of, uh, of content. There are not that many people out there who are gonna be able to create this, nor do they have the time, nor the knowledge, nor the experience, nor the expertise. We have done it for you. So all you have to do is purchase this and for once, I've also gone ahead and considered the fact that many of you, especially those of you in Europe, have requested that these should be able to be downloadable so we can save on cost and on the delay between here and shipping to you as well. So we've listened to you and we have made this in such a way that is very, very simple. All you do is go in when you make your purchase, make sure you put in the serial number of your instrument. Once you do that, click on your package, make your purchase, and within 24 to 48 hours, we shall actually email the file to you. Of course, that means that the file can only work in that particular instrument that you've provided the serial number to. So if you have four events, you're going to have to unfortunately make four purchases for all the four instruments because they all have different serial numbers. But the good thing is, guess what? You get to keep that stick. You get to keep that file. Sorry. You get to keep the file. And this file can always, if you have to re uh, reinstall or, or refresh the um, your hard drive for whatever reason you can always go ahead and reinstall this and get back up on your feet and running again so I leave you all uh, have a nice beautiful day or nice weekend wherever you are and go check out the HM Sonic Pro 1 package thank you mm -hmm.